Hi Libra, welcome to my Prime Moon Child. My name is Kaylee. This is the month ahead for April reading. Um, for your sign, it's a general read, so if it doesn't resonate, please take or leave what you need to this month. Um, as always, the housekeeping is down below. I'm just going to get down to the read. I'm basically going to pull one card for each quarter of the month. Um, very loose quarter of the month, like what uh, card is a week. And then an overall energy, a fifth card for the overall energy of this month. So let's see what we've got for you. So what have we got for Libra for the first week? You have the Seven of Swords. Be mindful of people around you who may be taking advantage of you this um, beginning of April. Um, they may not be everything that they appear to be. So be very mindful that people are capable of things. And by the look of it, people that you didn't think it was capable of to do those things to you. Um, I really feel deceit through this card rather than, and which I try and avoid with, with the meaning, but it really does feel like that. Somebody is cloak and dagger, um, very much waiting. They've been waiting in the wings to, to try something and they're going to try it this week. Um, yeah. And it's, and it's a self-preservation thing for them. They are literally concerned with themselves. Um, cause I'm really getting squirreling nuts away in a tree because they're hiding in a tree hole. Um, but yeah, they are, um, out for themselves to make sure they're all right i'm all right jack they're not really concerned with your feelings they're just trying to get what they can out of you this week libra um what have we got for the second week of april please ace of swords yeah clarity honesty and also cut probably what they're up to coming to light and having a very clear cutting out of um everything of this person possibly but there are some truths brutal truths being said this week whether that's to you or by you it just feels that there is a lot of clarity um, and honesty. Like things are going to come out that, that you probably from this Seven of Swords card the first week that you probably never thought was possible from this person. But it is going to come to the fore and there are going to be beautiful, brutal truths. And I see endings like you cutting them out because they're not serving your happiness. It's not healthy for you to have them around you. Um, so it really feels like that's what you'll be doing this second week. Uh, let's see what have we got for the third week of April we have the king of swords wisdom emotional there's a lot of sword energy in your read this month it is very much a mentally testing month um, I th feel like you're going to be shutting your emotions away a little bit and taking things merit on the evidence making decisions what's best for you and possibly your family um, if that's appropriate but you are very much making um clear decisions that don't affect anybody other than who is absolutely necessary within your kingdom, within your four walls. Um, you are very clear that you will not be emotionally manipulated anymore. You are very clear that you are not, um, while you take other people's emotions into account, they're not going to be used to control you anymore or your decision making. You are taking facts and evidence and unless anybody, if somebody wants you to treat you differently, um, you to treat them differently, then they need to behave differently because I feel like somebody has been saying to you, I'm sorry, I won't do this again or I'm sorry, da 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 and they don't change their behaviour. Um, and you're not standing for that anymore and if it's and you're setting very clear boundaries and if it's necessary you are cutting them out this month and I really like that energy Libra um what have we got for the final four the final card for this four weeks four quarters the final quarter of April that one Knight of Swords, again, Swords energy is just coming out in this. This is somebody making decisions, rash decisions possibly. Please don't make rash decisions. Also, um, a card of research, doing research. So the fact that Swords is also coming through, if this implies that something legal has to happen, be mindful of your words. Be mindful of getting the right advice. If it is to do with a legal situation, um, make sure you are getting um, suited and booted is what's coming in. You need to get the suits in if necessary or involve um, legal, I'm really getting legal. Um, but again, cutting emotion up, but the Knight of Swords can be rash with their words. So please don't rush into arguments. Be very mindful of your words this month. Um, don't give too much away if there is a you against them kind of situation. Um, be mindful of collecting the relevant evidence you need, keeping note of if it's text messages, letters, email, make sure everything is through written communication so you have evidence of people's behaviour or um, or communications, basically a paper trail. You, you, I'm really getting that you need a paper trail 
based on the fact that somebody has has shafted you basically um let's see what we've got for the overall energy for this month i wish this was a better read libra i really do you have the six of pentacles give and take balance ask for help if you need it this month judging by that you're going to need people around you to help support you do not be afraid to ask for help libra um, if this is to do with a relationship breakdown, there are people around you that can support you that I'm pretty sure you've helped out in the past and they are more than willing to give you support and help and financial, give you help feed you, help whatever you need. If you need company, they'll come and sit with you. If you need a meal cooked for you because you can't be bothered to cook, they will drop a meal on your doorstep. It's that sort of energy. There are people around you to help. If you do have a little excess, then absolutely feel free to share that around, Libra. Um, but I really feel like this is a battle that has been ongoing. I don't feel like it's the last battle. I feel like there's another one after this. Um, but I really hope that you have resilience within you. The Seven of Swords, although yes, it is somebody backstabbing, is also the card for me of tenacity, which means you have tenacity within you. You are more than capable of protecting yourself. That is very clear. And you're being reminded overall to ask for help if you need it, whether that's a legal help, like legal help like a solicitor or a barrister or whatever um even the police if it's required um but yeah there's there's something ongoing you need to start collecting evidence you need to keep a record of things if this is to do with a marriage breakdown with children keep a record of contact that they've had overnight and day um whether it's been a day um contact or overnight contact because in the uk that does affect child maintenance how many nights a year they have it and it just really feels like I have to say that because it really feels like a, a relationship breakdown. Keep everything in written um, communication because you need to show what the conversation was because over the telephone, he said, she said, does not does not fly when it comes to legal proceedings. Um, so, yeah, it kind of feels like that. Um, I hope that it is um, a decent month for you, April, um, Libra, for April, regardless of this um there is help around you and i think that's that's the sunshine to take from this read although this is pretty harsh and cold um this is love and support around you there are there's love and support around you if you require it um you only have to ask and you have to ask um i think some people may see it already but you, they don't want to tread on toes and if you need help ask for that help um yes yeah, hopefully that is of some help to you libra and i will see you again soon bye for now